what's up my transit gaming fans i went on a trip with some of my friends to an annual trip in downtown toronto called doors open now guys i did film quite a bit during that trip so expect a video of that awesome journey to come to the channel at a future date in this uh trip to doors open the TTC actually opened up the McCowan and Danforth yard facilities. Yeah, so those two facilities ended up being open to the public for that weekend. So, yeah, it was really awesome to go there and check out uh, the vehicles on display. But yeah, I was able to get myself two more brand new TTC cutout models that I haven't gotten before. And yeah, for this video, I'm gonna bring these out to show for the camera and fold them so I can add them to my growing collection of these uh, transit cutout models. Yeah, just let me go ahead and uh, grab the first cutaway model for the camera. Alright guys, so here's the uh, first cutout model that I'm gonna fold for the camera. So yeah, here is the cutout model of a TTC bus. Yeah, this is a model that I still don't have yet. Oh yeah, by the way, um, both of the models that I will showcase for the video today, um, the reason why I haven't gotten these before is, is because unfortunately, um, I believe last year during doors open, um, the TTC did open up the um, infamous lower bay station platform uh during the event one of my close friends was actually able to make it to that event and he was able to get the exact same two mo uh, cutout models so yeah super excited to finally be able to get um those two now so as you can see guys yeah here is a um cutout model of one of the uh current bosses in the uh, ttc fleet so yeah this appears to be based on uh, one of the hybrid electric Nova buses. Okay, so yeah, for this one, I'm gonna have to uh, pop out the entire thing. So yeah, this won't be too hard. Yeah, I'm actually surprised at how um, well this model um, stayed together for the uh, entire day, yeah. Like, that day during doors open, there was a lot of moving around and having to transport um, those two cutaway models like that was pretty difficult. Like, I'll explain more about it later, but yeah, okay, so I'm gonna slowly pop these out. Right, wait, actually, maybe I need to aim the camera a bit lower. Okay, yeah, about, yeah, I believe this is a better view. Yeah, I'm gonna move this here. Yeah, you guys can see this going on a lot better, but yeah, okay, I'm gonna slowly pop this out yeah actually i'm gonna do the sides first because yeah this is a tad bit easier wow can't wait to finally get my hands on this one for my collection wow i've been waiting for this for quite some time oh wow i'm in yeah i'm in yeah these are smaller black parts um, yeah, sticking out as you can see there. Um, yeah, these are gonna be a tad bit tricky to get out. Uh, yeah, I don't want to accidentally tear one of these by accident. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna do this as carefully as I can. Oh, freak. Okay, yeah, it's just about like doing it slowly and carefully. Yeah, see, that's the thing, guys. Oh, no, wait, actually. Okay, I don't know how bad this is, yeah, because, yeah, you can see on the camera, yeah, these look a little bit ripped, uh, yeah, on, on the side there. I don't know, yeah, so, because of that, I want to be as careful with it as possible. Oh, frick, yeah, this is bad. Um, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, but luckily, it's not damaged to the point where, um, yeah, it's, it's just gonna rip off the... Uh, black rectangle completely. Yeah, that's what we don't want to happen. Okay, there we go. Got it. Okay, so we got that side, and then let's do the back. Got it. Okay, so that's okay, 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 that's just one side. Okay. 
Oh, all right. Yeah, perfect. We got yeah this much of it out. Yeah, we got this much of it out. Okay, yeah, it's just the front end now. Oh, wait, what the heck is that? Um, okay, that is interesting. Yeah, I didn't, yeah, I did, I did not see that. Yeah, you can see, yeah, I don't know if you guys can see, uh, at the front there. Oh no, yeah, you can see that, yeah, even the mirrors, um, have it, has its own, like, um, separate, uh, I think, groove section. Like, I believe that's supposed to fold outwards, um, later on. So, oh man, I gotta be careful with that as well, though. Okay, got it. And there we go. What the heck? Oh, I could see like some tiny bits of paper ripping out like that, but yeah, I don't think. Yeah, I think that's fine though. Okay, yeah. The entire thing is out as you can see. Now, yeah, I'm gonna set this off to the side there. Right, first thing I would do is, um, yeah, fold up the, um, parts that form around the um, rectangle, the main rectangle here, which would uh, form the um, roof of the bus. So yeah, I'm gonna start on, I'm gonna start with this. Yeah, I'm just gonna fold this a little bit like so. Yup, so I can, yeah, make it, yeah, make it look like this. Uh, yeah. Yeah, this is gonna be a, a relatively easy fold. Yeah, this is gonna be a relatively easy one to make. Okay, I'm gonna do the same thing for the other side. Uh, okay. And then, oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm not gonna do the uh, front and back ends yet. Okay, now, I'm gonna s carefully um, pop out the um, little wheel sections. Um, yeah. I don't know if you can see, yeah, for the first wheel here, um, yeah, I you can see that I have it pop out carefully because I don't want um, the um, wheel there to end up like being folded uh, inwards as well because yeah because you want the wheels to be um, sit sticking out yeah because you want the wheels to be sticking out and yeah have it touch the ground in the uh, final product i don't know if that's a good way to explain it okay i'm gonna fold the um yeah this black section here which would be the bottom of the bus like this and perfect okay yeah so then now which okay so now uh we can easily form uh the rectangle shape, the uh, prism shape, that would form the uh, main body of the bus. Now, uh, for these little uh, parts here, um, okay, I gotta figure out how to do this though. What if I folded this smaller uh, black part uh, inwards? What if I did that instead? Okay, so, like this. Right. Oh, and then, yeah, you can see because I did that, um, oh wait, I don't know if I can show it to you. Oh yeah, so, you can see that, um, yeah, the wheels fit perfectly on the bottom of the bus like this. Yeah, I don't know if, if that's illustrating it enough. Okay, and then... Oh, and then do we fold the um, small rectangle parts like upward? Yeah, and then you can see here that um, there are like tiny grooves here. Um, now these would actually end up like popping out completely. And then, yeah, so then these like tiny parts that come out will end up like throwing away later. Uh, okay, so maybe it's like this. Okay, so we slowly pop this inside. Oh, perfect! Yeah, so that's how we end up like this. Okay, okay, so, oh yeah, so I get it now. These ones, you have, yeah, these little black parts that stick out, you have to fold upwards. So that they will actually f uh, fit into the little um, holes. Oh, 
Yes, okay, we got the next one, and then let's try to get the middle one in. Oh, yeah. Okay, I've, yeah, I have to be careful and delicate about this. Ooh. Okay, yeah, so the key is to try to, like, target, like, the bottom of the groove so that it actually, um, pushes in easier, but, okay, I think we got it. Okay, so it looks like we did it. Bottom of the bus is secure. Now, let me, uh, go ahead and, uh, slow, and, oh, sorry, and slightly, um, fold the, um, front cap, uh, downwards like that uh, oh and then you have another you have another one of these um, like small parts sticking out as well uh, wait so how does that work um, oh okay 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 so I have to fold this inward as well oh there we go perfect um, yeah that looks like that looks like the way to do it but Actually, before this goes in, I'm gonna have to fold this and I think this in as well. Actually, and maybe and maybe try to slowly um, like separate um, this white outline with the um, actual mirrors themselves. Yeah, maybe yeah, maybe I should do that. Yep, just be careful with this. That's it. Perfect. Very slowly get it in. Oh, I think we got it. I'm still not liking the um, shape of the front of the bus. I might have I might have folded it wrong though. I think, guys, this is probably the best we can get the uh, forward cap like this. Ugh, dang, I just don't like. That it looks a tad bit crooked. Uh, wait, yeah, it looks like a, it looks a little crooked. Did I do it wrong? Hold up, there might be a, there might be a part at the bottom here that I actually need to fold. Um, yeah, guys, I think, I think this really is the best we can uh, get this. Dang, I'm actually a little baffled on how the uh, front, the uh, front end of the bus looks. Okay, but that's all right. Let me go ahead and do the back of the bus now. Uh, yeah, same thing, just like fold the, uh, the, uh, angular part, sorry, the, uh, trapezoid parts inwards. And then, yeah, I think the black part in as well. I don't get why, I don't get why it feels so loose. Yeah, I think they made, it, like, these grooves a little too big. I think they made these, like, holes a little too big. Like, I get that they're supposed to be, like, relatively easy folds for, like, the kids and stuff, but, oh man, I don't know how to feel about this. Okay. Yeah. yeah but yeah, I can't figure out if I'm doing this wrong in any way, but I guess we'll just leave it like, oh wait. Yeah, we'll just leave it like this. Uh, it looks a little prettier, but yeah. I think that's all I can really do. All right, with the uh, first uh, cutout model done, I'm gonna go ahead and bring in the second one. All right, guys. So here's the second bigger model um, that I'm really excited to add to my collection, and it's also a lot more fragile than the other one. Here is a cutout model of the. Uh, TDC's Toronto Rocket subway train. So yeah, the TRs. Yeah, this is a pretty big um, model right here, and also doesn't look too difficult to uh, fold. But hopefully we can pull off the design, and uh, hopefully it doesn't look too crooked, just like the last one. Because of how big this um, cutout model is, it is yeah. You can see that it is incredibly fragile, and yeah, it was hard to. Um, carry this around uh, in a plastic bag all day during the uh, doors open events. It was pretty hard to do that and I tried so hard to um, I guess to let as little of the um, model as you can see here come out of the cardboard as possible. Yeah almost all of the uh, model as you can see here has pretty much um, came out of the uh, cardboard already. But yeah I believe it's just the um, 
forward cab as you can see here just holding the rest of the thing together like desperately and yeah i did manage to grab myself a spare um in case anyone else uh wanted it and or i guess it becomes valuable in the future but yeah in fact you guys could probably get this and uh the bus as well in a future ttc event so yeah what i highly suggest you guys doing is i guess um Keep up to date with uh, news, whether it's on uh, Twitter or on uh, the TTC's social media platforms, or even just online for any future um, TTC events. Because chances are, guys, um, you guys will be able to get your hands on your own um, cutout models uh, when the TTC hands them out during these events. Um, special and exclusive events but yeah enough talk um wow um okay so yeah this one will be pretty easy to slide out yeah even this part here managed to stay together pretty well but it won't matter now because it's all coming out oh wow and just like that it is oh wow yeah just like that it is out i'm gonna set this to this set this off to the side all right so yeah here's what the um subway train looks like yeah this is pretty cool love the details um especially um in the uh forward cab as you can see here yeah love the details okay so yeah first things first let's go ahead and fold the uh, the uh, main sides together yeah, I'm going to fold these uh, inwards, as usual. Alright, perfect. And same goes for the other side. Oh, I, guys, I just wish, like, the TTC made these uh, for the uh, T1 subway cars as well. Yeah, because that would be, oh wow, because that would be really cool. Yeah, the T1s, uh, the, yeah, the TTC still runs these on the Line 2. Yeah, unfortunately, yeah, the T1s are pretty much uh, one of the only reminiscences to um, TTC's um, OG subway trains. Like, yeah, the Hawker Siddeley ones are gone. Uh, yeah, those were just very nostalgic machines. Okay, now, uh, yeah, with the parts all folded in, I'm gonna... Wow, okay, so I'm gonna make... Yeah, so I'm gonna pop the... Um, wheels out as well yep carefully yep perfect wait what the heck what okay wow that sounded for a while that sounded for a second there like um some part was like ripping off the um entire thing like it's not supposed to this looks a little um dangerous i don't want to like end up tearing like any part of the uh, cardboard okay oh I gotta stop dropping this nicely. Okay. And I think for this one, you're supposed to fold it, like, all the way in. Yep, all the way. Yep, that's it. And then, uh, yeah, same goes to the other side. Oh, what the? Did that sound? Okay, I don't think that sounded like it was supposed to rip. What the heck? Okay, maybe, okay, maybe this is normal. Yeah, I don't know what's going on here. Um, okay. Now, what I'm gonna do is figure out a way to attach, um, yeah, these two, uh, black parts together. Um, yeah, I think one of my, um, other TTC cutouts are pretty similar to this. Oh, okay, yeah, and I think the way to do it is... I'm pretty sure the way to do it is um, actually fold, um, yeah, these things as you can see here. Yeah, these things as you can see here, uh, just fold them downwards. Or is it upwards? Yeah, I think, no, wait, I think it's upwards. Oh, wait, that's my bad. I think it's upwards. Yep, so that it looks like uh, this. Do the same thing for all the other side, all the other ones. Oh, I forgot how tricky this was to do. Oh! Oh, perfect! Yep. Oh, come on. Oh, I just came out. Oh, I came out again. No, 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 no. Oh, wow. 
You know what? Maybe it is better to do the middle ones first. Yeah, I'm trying to figure this out, guys. I'm trying to figure this out. Alright, looks like we got one of these for um, the uh, back side here in. Oh, I gotta figure out how to do that for the other side still. Wow, but getting the middle one in is so tricky. Because it's so far in, and I think I kind of need, like, uh, additional finger support, like, near it. Oh. Oh, come on. Are you kidding me? Oh! Okay, we got it. Did it go in completely? I think it did. I think it went in. Yeah, I think all these did go in completely. So, are we good here? Yeah, I believe we are good here. So I think we did it. Okay. I hope the uh, front and back ends don't look crooked when I eventually do these. Okay, so I think these things go up. Okay. Up. And then uh, these ones off to the side in. Oh, no, 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 no. I, I gotta do this more carefully. Because it feels like I'm just, like, squishing it. I just open it up a little bit. Yep, so that they can slide in easier. Okay. Oh! I think we did it! Okay! Okay, okay, okay. So the front cab is done. Yeah, look at that. Okay. Now for the back. Yeah, the back should be a little bit easier, I believe. Yeah, just, and then just rotate this down. Oh, actually, I gotta fold in the parts first. Open the, uh, the tiny grooves here. Yeah, I gotta open these downwards so that they can act, so that they can fit through a bit easier. Oh! Okay! I think we did it! Let's go! Let's go! Okay, that was a little stressful, but yeah, this is the completed Toronto Rocket subway car. Oh wow, look at that. Wow, this is, wow, this looks really cool. All right guys, so I think that was just about it for this video. Uh, so folding two more uh, brand new TTC cutout models uh, for my collection now oh man still a little stumped about the Nova bus though like I still can't figure out why some of the parts are still kind of loose and why it's um, making it look a little crooked I may or may not have to polish it off with um, a bit of tape later but yeah, this is probably the best as I can get it. Uh, I don't know how my friend folded up his. But yeah. These are two models. Two brand new cutout models for the collection. Oh wow, these look really, really awesome. But yeah, hopefully we get um, more brand new ones uh, made by the TTC. And yeah, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Uh, leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe. And yeah, I'll be seeing you guys on the next video.